Hi Aries, this is your reading with me for the 24th to the 30th of January. We're going to see what is coming through, what messages, information and clarity I can also give to you as well. And I have the Oracle card. So I just wanted to mention that this is for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs for Aries. And also if you would like to win a free reading with me, check out the description box below since I do giveaways every single month as well. Um, I also offer personal services and also readings and also the intention items, which thousands of people have seen results with on my website. You can scroll to the bottom of my website to see the reviews on the intention items. And uh, yeah, they're really special. Um, so there's, you know, service is also like black magic removal which is extremely popular right now and um, there's also different healing works and things like that that I do um, with you but there is also of course the um, items for lots of different intentions that you want to manifest and then in those categories there is of course you know bracelets necklaces anklets pom-poms tassels embroidered cards which you can put under your pillow your wallet or your purse these are handmade items they are meditated with and staged there's also teas and crystals and well the crystals are hand sourced but there's also the sage bundles which are put together um, of course by hand and there's also the candles as well which are handmade and hand poured and they are really really special because they are plant-based and safety tested anywho everything is on shopmoonlightguidance.com okay so let's check this out aries and see what's coming through for you all right let's start with the oracle cards we have got here ooh -hoo. Ooh -hoo -hoo -hoo. when a door closes another one opens it's as simple as that and that is exactly what I'm seeing here is that there is a new encounter there is a new opportunity there is a beginning right like there is a door that actually opens and that is absolutely incredible so we've got here connection you are very connected to the heavenly realms we've got here creative projects it is time to get things done make your creative projects a priority right now also because you're going to have so much more energy to actually do these projects this week. You know sometimes how you have projects or you've got things to do and you just kind of don't really want to do them. You want to do other things. Sometimes you want to procrastinate. Well, this week you feel good. You're like, yeah, of course, going to get it done. Going to get it done. I want to do it. You have that motivation, that desire towards creative projects. I think that's beautiful. You know, it's, it's so much better than not wanting to do it. You know what I mean? Um, and that's what I see. But also someone here can actually offer you um, a creative project and be like, would you be interested in helping me with this and doing this? And I just feel like so many of you would be like, yeah, cool. You know, I, I think some of you will also get compensated nicely for it as well, getting something in return that you want. Um, and then we've got new door. Your prayers have been answered and a new door is being held open for you. Amazing, right? It's literally being held open for you. So for those of you struggling with work, with career, with sort of having these opportunities, the door is opening. I also feel in regards to love, all right? That's the other thing as well, is in regards to love, there is a really, really beautiful energy here, you know, and I think uh, that is just absolutely stunning because you will just feel like you're, you know, you're, what you, what you wanted is, is being answered, your prayers are being answered, and you'll feel so much more excited in the grand scheme of things. So that, we've also got here the Knight of Cups and the Knight of Swords, so... Romantically, if a door also closed for you, there can be people here that are actually really attracted to you and uh, you may find that they're just kind of looking over at you, glancing at you. Um, if you are someone that say, for example, that, you know, is primarily at home or you work from home um, or it's kind of part of your lifestyle, even on social media or people that have known you from the past can really be thinking about you and thinking about your character and your qualities and your characteristics. So it's not necessarily that this has to be in person. Even at a distance, people can be thinking about you and the beautiful qualities that you actually exude and that you give out are very, very attractive, um, specifically in this week. Here you are feeling so strong. Aries, I love, I love seeing your strength. Okay, an incredible affirmation is I am strong. And you know, that willpower just really allows you to get through anything that you need to get through this week. I think that's incredible. I think it's amazing. I think it's so, so, so powerful. I am strong. Comment it down below. 
amazing affirmation. We've got here the Wheel of Fortune, which is opportunities to do with money, which we did speak about before as well. When one door closes, another one opens. If you have recently found out that you have been terminated in employment, or if you have been, um, you've gone through like a separation, for example, another door will open for you. And um, you'll find that again, there's, there's this opportunity, right? It's, it's not like it's a completely gone done situation where you're never going to get something in return it will come jupiter is on your side jupiter of course is the planet of opportunity and luck luck is one of those things that so many people talk about and you know i i want to say one thing i do agree with that i do believe that some people are luckier than others and it's it you know it's one of those things some people have more in their destiny and their fate um than others do and you know it's it's one of those things where I think it's good to sort of count your blessings to know that yes you are lucky and these things will come to you um but also to not you know invalidate yourself especially if things have gone wrong it's about you know kind of working through that emotionally validating yourself that's okay as well um but yes I, I do believe that you're you have a stroke of luck here um but you also have this strength and willpower that allows you to work towards these opportunities hence also getting them so whether you believe in luck or not it's a personal choice, but I do believe that there is a real beautiful sense here of things changing. And again, you having these new doors um, and windows <laughs> open up for you. Okay, there you go. Brand new beginning, fresh new start. I'm telling you here, okay, there is a chance encounter. Someone here is going to communicate with you. They're going to come forward. They're going to express this opportunity to you and it's going to be your choice whether you want to take part or not. Like I mentioned, for some of you, it is career related and for some of you, it is money related and kind of work and job related. So keep that in mind, but you'll know what it is about because this door has previously closed on you. Okay, so depending on what door closed on you, that's the one that's opening up this week. Okay, so that's how you'll know which part of your <laughs> kind of like life it resonates with. Whoa, there's a lot of cards, but that's cool. Um, three of cups. Okay, nice. There's a lot more respect from people around you. They seem to be really understanding um, the ways in which you talk and the ways in which you do things and the ways in which you are kind and caring. There's a real sense here of people clicking with you. Now, what I mean by this, the best way I can describe it is, you know, at school, I guess that's not really the best way to describe it. Um, you kind of have like groups of people sometimes, right? Sometimes you have like groups of people that sort of just get on very well and they form their own little groups. Well, here I see that there are people that kind of are coming to you and kind of welcoming you into their group and wanting to talk to you and chat with you. And you'll be like, oh, OK, that's interesting. So there's a real sense here of being involved and sort of invited. Does that make sense? Hopefully that makes sense. It's the best way I can describe it. It's it's sort of like being invited um, also into social situations or into groups. Like, for example, you might be invited into like a group WhatsApp group um, or a WhatsApp chat, should I say? A WhatsApp group chat. There we go. And, you know, it's a real sense here of, again, being invited. Um, so that's interesting. There's also social energy here. We have the Six of Cups as the opportunity that gets, um, um, that gets offered to you. Hermit here. The beginning portion of the week may be a bit slow. Okay, but the, the wheel turns. A new opportunity comes your way. <laughs> the cards are just like, no. <laughs> um, and then, of course, you know, this is very creative. Of course, you've got Venus energy, which is about passion and things that you love to do, but also you're feeling very respected. Again, you've got the Queen of Wands, which is very much so your energy, whether you're male or female. I read energies in tarot, not specifically genders. So you're feeling very confident, very stable, very happy, very fulfilled, happy with the Sun card as well. New opportunity. And a lot of you will think like, wow, you know, things really came together in divine timing. Things really progressed in divine timing. And you may see 11-11 a lot, which means you're on the right path in your life like things really are working out for you for the better and the nine of wands is a lot of ideas that you have in regards to creative projects which i think is very very interesting so your mind creatively is very very uplifted and you're feeling very strong very courageous you're feeling very much so like yourself and this is why opportunities are also flooding your way because this is the vibrational energy to be in to basically manifest these areas of your life which is incredible areas so we see here opportunity is your prayers will be answered okay so this is your reading 
Now, if this reading resonates with you or if you claim it, don't forget to like, share, subscribe and comment down below. And also remember that affirmation, I am strong, um, because that's strength card right, <laughs> right there. And also everything is in the description box below for the free reading giveaway, personal services, the intention items, which are on my website. I also have TikTok and Instagram where I post short readings on there every single day. If you want to follow me on there, everything's linked down below and I'll see you all very soon.